let's continue. Go into the, s the swamp palace. Hang on. Ah, gotta get more comfortable. Moist Palace. <laughs> I mean, yeah, this is effectively this game's uh, water dungeon. But these weren't bad. I mean, I can't speak for this one, but the one in the Link to the Past was fine. important. Funky music. It's sort of a remix of Zelda 1's dungeon music. There's like a little bit of a melody from, from that dungeon. It's its own thing, but it borrows a little bit of it. Oh, that's nothing. Oh, I have to grab it from the other side. Wait, 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 I know what this is. Oh, you can't latch onto chests? Okay. But there will be a, there will be a puzzle like this. I can almost guarantee it. I was trying to go on the wall, but okay, that doesn't even work. It's all bookshot related. Which is fine, like, this this is a nod to the original dungeon in A Link to the Past. It was the hookshot dungeon. This may very well be a march to the end, by the way. Like, if this dungeon takes me an hour, and the next dungeon takes me an hour, that's both done, and then it's the final area. I might very well get this done tonight. Because it's, it's, it's not even 10 o'clock here yet, so... There's still time. much more intricate.
Uh oh. Okay, it looks like that's doing damage, so just stick stick to this. It's, it's, it's obviously gonna divide, so... <laughs> okay, that's not what I was expecting. Ah! That usually indicates the halfway mark, but I feel like it's a bit early for that. See, this is on the... I probably have to do this on both sides. I'll just prepare the other one. Yeah, it's the same thing. I should have looked at the mini-map on the bottom. looking this is the one that I was thinking was gonna happen so hold up It needs to be higher. Whoa. I didn't know you could do that. I can I can do it from here. Maybe. Okay, that makes it a little easier. I thought this was gonna be way more complicated.
Oh, this one's awkward. Oh, wait. No, it's fine. I got it. 3D. Ah, <laughs> oh, I didn't pull the raft. I guess I just have to make sure it's on both sides. Oh, but see, this needs a key as well. Hmm. Okay, maybe I missed what I was supposed to do. Oh, this just leads back here. Alright. Seeing what my options are. Oh. There's a tap there that I need to open. On. Okay, it's up higher. Did I maybe do the wrong thing first? Just put it 
Oh, that's it. That's it. That's it, guys. Yeah, I think I did the wrong thing first. Oh. Well, that answers my question. Alright. This should have happened a long time ago. So I probably did the dungeons out of order. <laughs> probably did the harder ones later. They were intended for later first. Okay, now we have blue lonk. That's good. Blonk. <laughs> and then red lo red lonk is ronk. Pink lonk is punk. Plonk. That still doesn't really clarify anything, though. Like, it's nice that the water level's up, but it didn't open anything new. the 3DS had more Zelda games that were new. Yeah. But I mean, it's nice that Ocarina and Majora's were remade. I guess that's what you would lose. I'm just hoping that the Switch does 2D Zelda games and doesn't just abandon them. I mean, we, we did get Link's Awakening, but I'm talking about like something new. Hmm. If I overlook something minor. Oh, you know, redo Oracle of Seasons and Ages, that'd be great. This is the problem. Does, I need to get a I need to get a chest. Which chest? Minus Cap would be a great remake. It would. But I mean, Link's Awakening is on the online thing as well. Now, not that it was ever, but. I don't think that would stop them from remaking it. What is this? What what am I what am I forgetting here? I rose the water level. But it only affected that room, not every other room. Unless it could go one more, but Wait, apparently there's a chest here. You weren't stuck with the remake of Link's Awakening. Oh. Okay, there we go. Why did I not, why didn't I see that? Ah! 
try too hard with visuals. Okay, I guess that makes sense. I think the blur on the edge. They should have. They should have done something like this. This looks really good. If they would have done it in this style, I think it would have worked better. I, I do agree, but I still enjoyed it. Like, this isn't over the top, and it's still pretty nice. Apparently there's still a chest here. How? how? There's probably, like, a hidden button or something. The frame drops so bad, they were, yeah. But that's just the, the Switch in general. What the... I don't see another chest, and yet the marker still says there's one. If they do more any 2.5D games, hope they take a less is more approach to the graphics. For the sake of performance, yeah. This is the part that I'm really not getting, is why... Ice rod? It's not like the sand rod, though. I guess I don't think it is. Nah. It doesn't make pops. It's, uh... I've overlooked something minor. I find it weird that it still says there's a chest in this room. So this, this is... I rose the water level. Yeah, look. If I go down one floor... Hang on. Not here, but down one floor it does. This is the part I don't get, is like, I rose the water level here, but it hasn't had an effect anywhere else. There's gonna be a simple answer to this. I tried dra Maybe draining it is the answer. I, I drained it, but I didn't drain it fully. And go back and see if it had an effect on other parts of the dungeon, so maybe that's it. I think that might be what I've done wrong. Okay. Let's see. Nope. Oh, that's for the chest above, okay. Yeah, see, this did nothing. Will this stream be part on the archive? Uh, it will be. However, it might be a while before it's on there, because the way it's going... It's publishing all the playthroughs one by one. 
It's just to buy- the way I run the archive is to buy myself time because it's only me doing it. Uh, it publishes them like every second day. So I think right now it's up to what Zelda game is it? Hold up, I need to check. They all will end up on there, just not right away. It's up to Wind Waker at the moment. It's up to Wind Waker now, so they do all... They, they are publishing. I think with Tears of the Kingdom, that one I will try to get done immediately. It's just... Making thumbnails for a whole series and doing that every day, it just, it takes a while. But it will end up on there. And that also allows there to be a new VOD every day, practically, on that channel. So it's always active. I really hope one day I can get it to the point where there's not too much of a gap between uh, when I stream and then when a VOD ends up on that channel. But, yeah. It's just... Currently with me only doing it and wanting to stream and also edit content and full-time work, it's just... I gotta pick my battles. have a large backlog too. Yeah. It's one of those things where if, let's say I, I were to stream two days less a week, and then, I could then I could probably stay on top of the, the VODs thing, but then I'm not streaming as much. Like if I did half a week of streaming and then the rest to just catch up on content. I, I'm gonna hate this because the answer to this is going to be so dumb. <laughs> I've over I've overlooked something very minor and I hate it. But I've been running around in circles trying to figure out what this is and I need a key. That's all I need to, to go forward, but the result of this room hasn't had an effect on the rest of the dungeon. What is this over here? Oh, you wanker. I see it. Okay, I see it. I see it. I am, uh, very happy though, chat, and people watching later on YouTube, that the VODs channel does get more, uh, use nowadays. It does mean a lot when I see that. I will, I will make the effort with Tears of the Kingdom when I'm playing that to put that up right away. So pretty much when I'm done with the stream, I'll upload it, and then the next day during lunch break, I'll just make the thumbnail. So that's what I'll do with that game. Because it's probably my best interest to do that, as opposed to let it go. They're always on Twitch as well. I guess that's the other thing, is if you do miss out, they are always here. I don't do any of that thing where, oh, you need to be subscribed to our watch past streams. So they will remain on Twitch 
as long as Twitch allows them to be on Twitch. Which I think is like 60 days. So. Just, I, I understand Twitch is not the best viewing experience. YouTube's definitely a much better viewing experience for, uh, for VODs. Wait, can I merge while I'm on there? Okay, I just have to be quick. You find it the opposite. You find the player on Twitch better. I guess this is... This is, this is speaking from... Uh, I suppose it depends how you do it, but I find that I watch VODs on, on a TV, right? And the TV experience on Twitch is really, really not great. It's improved recently, but it's still not great. I can understand wanting to see chat, but... Sometimes the stream is, is pretty quiet, so there's not much chat anyway. If I was ever get to get to the point where, like, the stream is big enough and the, act, the chat is pretty active the majority of the time, there is a way to, uh... There's an extension I think you can get where... I don't know how other streamers do it, but I've seen it. Um... When you're watching a YouTube video, you can have the Twitch... What was the Twitch chat on the VOD on YouTube? It's just... Uh, there's a bit of work for it, so... I haven't looked into it because it's not something that uh, I have the time to do. But it's doable, I've definitely seen it. I guess it just depends on your preferences. At the end of the day. You would love to be able to watch the upcoming Zelda playthrough without missing something on your TV, and it's much more convenient than Twitch, yeah. That That's how I feel, it's just... And... One, an one annoying thing that, um... The TV app has started doing... It doesn't always show your followers list completely now. So sometimes when I'll, I'll put Twitch on the TV, there's some people that I know are currently live and it's not on the list at all. So, hello caller and good morning. Uh, this is only one dungeon after where I left off. I did the ice dungeon and then I did exploration. So, it's not too far into the future. Though that being said, I have acquired a lot of stuff since then. Well, for Tears of the Kingdom, I, I will endeavor to do it. If not the the very next day, I'll make the VODs, like, available, uh, as soon as, as I can. It's just, it's all a time constraint. I have a key, I need to look where, where to do the most good. I think it's not using it there. Do I have a switch hooked up on the TV? Uh, I can have one hooked up. But I like the conveniences of the smart TV as well.
Wait, can I still go this way? I think I can. Okay, now I pull this up. Oh, I have two keys. But I don't have to open that door. I mean, the other thing I've been debating on doing, because, okay, here's, here's the thing, right? The only reason that I don't really, like, I can upload the VOD to YouTube immediately, right? When I wrap the stream up, it's not a huge effort for me to, uh, just go upload it and leave it like that. The problem comes with what's required to publish it, which is make a thumbnail, the descriptions, uh, just maybe any editing that has to come with it, because sometimes I do have to touch things up here and there. That's the part that takes a while, not the uploading. But I know that people also... I don't know how they do it, but... They can make uploads available to a group of people before they go public. I just... I've never looked into that kind of stuff. But usually it's done in the context of, like, Patreon and incentivizing people to pay, which I'm not ever gonna do. But if enough people wanted an upload right away, like, I could, I could look into it. Just allowing that somehow. Never heard about that. I know people do it. I'm just not sure how they do it. They make the videos private and then share the link to that group. So I would imagine, what, it's tied to... Okay, that makes sense, because there's certain posts you need to be a supporter on Patreon to see, so that's how they do it. Okay. Yeah, honestly, if, if there was a way... I could automate that and just be like, the moment I make something private, just share the link in the channel in Discord. Hey, that would be that would be the easy way to do it, but I'm not sure that's possible. Because I, if memory serves me correctly, YouTube only lets things know when things go public. There are certainly bots for that. I know that there's bots for publishing because I got one for the I've done it for the highlights channel. But I, because it's not technically sharing and it doesn't notify anyone, that's why I, I kind of question it. I might do some reading on it. If it's not a pain in the ass to set up, I, I can just set it up. And then I'll just put it on Discord. It already sounds complicated. Well... My job for, like, a good decade was, uh, like, s software development. Mainly front-end stuff, but I have done technical stuff, so... If I see it as something that's not too tricky to set up, I can, I can set it up. I mean, my BRB screens and stuff, I made- I made that myself, so... I'm capable. It's just, these days, it's more about how much time it takes. Granted, I haven't really coded anything in like, three years, four years now. 
It is setting it to unlisted. Okay. Yeah, I, I understood what you meant, though. But then... I guess I need to read it, but, like, when the video does go public, does it still notify your subscribers? Or does it become funny about that? Because I'll tell you this right now, all, all of them are, si are sitting there and they have schedules. Like, up until Skyward Sword, all of them are sitting there and they have schedules just waiting, waiting to go out. If I can keep that schedule and be able to share that link with someone, then hey, that's ideal. But if it's a case of, like, sacrificing that and then I have to remember, oh, on this day I have to make it public, then yeah, that, that's not great. This is stuff that I should read up on. I don't know why I'm asking. <laughs> I'm just thinking out loud here. Sorry, I should be focusing on the dungeon. But I'd always try... I want to make the viewing experience as best as possible for people. So I do try to accommodate requests where possible. Wait, do I need to go down here or the other one? No, this is just going back. Apparently, you're clueless. Clueless for what? What have I missed here? I press the- I push the button. Damn, this goes down. Or is this nothing? Yeah, this is- this is what I get for just talking and not paying attention to what I'm doing. <laughs> Someone's probably internally screaming already, just, oh my god, just... I mean, water dungeons. No, so the button is pressed, so whatever is... Whatever the end result of this was, it's been done. Out of something. Does this affect one or both? No, it affects both. Okay, so it's the room water level. I just noticed that the bottom one wasn't completely full, so. Okay. Also fix the bot. It's doing announcements again. I don't know why they broke. Ah! 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 ah. <laughs> so I have to pull it back one. But then I can't. No, 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 I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't. This is done manually in this room. I was about to make a grave error. It's done here. How it's done here, I'm not sure, but it should be done here. Okay, there we go. Mystery solved. 
You know what? This is still within the realm of good time. I said about an hour. It's only been 40 minutes. Okay. There we go. Wind Waker was a fun playthrough, except for the part where I lost my mind looking for a heart piece for three hours. I, I wish I could say that was good, but it wasn't. I mean, maybe entertaining because I get annoyed. But it was my first time playing that game, and I did enjoy it. This is just autopilot for me. Except this part, this is new. <laughs> but, a link to the past boss. Hitless! No damage! So, I'm missing four heart pieces, right? If I was to base this off anything. Yeah, that's because that was, that was a boss from A Link to the Past. Once more, you have come to my rescue, Lunkles. How I wish I could again reward you with a gift, something that would calm the troubled waters of your journey. I can only offer you my deepest gratitude, and yet another task, I'm afraid. You must rescue every one of the seven sages, and only together can we help you defeat this great evil. Alright, I'll tell you what, I'll read into this stuff tomorrow about YouTube. I mean, it's a long weekend, I should probably do something semi-productive. <laughs> I have been lazing about the past few days, I should do something. Oh, lovely Zelda, can you sense it? Our brave hero almost has the Triforce of Courage. Lowrul will be saved, thanks to him, and one princess to another? I can't tell you how grateful I am. Yeah, do this. Okay, we're just gonna make one pit stop, but I'm gonna go straight to the next dungeon, so... This is back-to-back -back dungeons. And potentially a march to the end, I'm not sure. I guess it depends if there's like a Tower of Hera sort of a uh, dungeon or not. Because if there is, then that accounts for the final heart pe the heart container, sorry. Still not there yet. There's still the other piece of ore as well that I need to find. Come on. Surely this is it. No, still not it. <laughs> How much money is she gonna take from me? 
Okay, I'll be back. That's all I, I wanted to do. Then we just go straight there. Back-to-back -back dungeons! Oh wait, there's a heart piece over there. Yeah, then there are, there are three heart pieces missing. Ooh, this is interesting. There are three heart pieces missing. I don't have any idea where they could be. Ah, freeze, okay. I might have to turn up the 3D effect a little. This dungeon is very reliant on uh, perspective here. I need to be able to tell what's on what la layer. This is this is just like Turtle Rock. Uh, <laughs> I was looking for the fire rod and couldn't find it. Um, just hold up. If we go to, to like this layout instead, I thought that that was uh that looked like honey, <laughs> like a stick that has just gone into honey. I didn't think that was the fire rod. Anyway. I know, idiot. Ah, uh, yes, the, the honey rod, a staple of the Zelda series. Oh, come on. I <laughs> can't get either of those. I believe this was a poor choice. Problem. Or can I? I see this is still on a, on a higher level. I just went down, so I can't get back up. Is this? Uh, 
As a parasite, it should be more adventurous. Okay. I need to be more adventurous. Ah! Wait a minute. Okay, there we go. This is certainly a weird problem to solve. This dungeon has a great song. Most of the dungeons do. Well, say hey, Cookie. Oh, what? Ooh, this one's protected. Wow. Smart was robe. <laughs> uh... What do? A bomb? You might be right. I just kind of assumed that. I was gonna say, I kind of assumed that uh, it just required ice to defeat, but you're right. That looks nice. I said this earlier, but I'll say it again for the newcomers, like, update on the Mario movie thing is the, uh, in case anyone's interested. Hang on. Ah, the, the metallic tin where I got my popcorn, apparently that's like a worldwide thing. So, that's how they're doing popcorn everywhere. I know Americans that have gotten it, and I also know Europeans that have gotten it. So if you do go see the movie, you can get one of those metallic tins. I mean, they are pretty neat. I have stored stuff in it, and they're not that small. Well, that's just all going to go to that fairy. Your popcorn was just in a normal bag. No, it's like a... It's a special order. Like, I don't know. It's definitely not a small popcorn bag. It's like whatever the largest combo you can possibly get. At least I assume. It was here. I just heard people talking about the metallic tin. What am I missing here? 
Oh, I haven't got in here. That makes sense. I mean, maybe it's not like a something that's available at every cinema, but it's definitely something they're doing worldwide. Wait, that was nothing. I guess this is just to go back. I see where there's keys. I need to head to where there's keys. That doesn't work. Oh, this is a puzzle. No, I don't care. <laughs> oh, it's on a higher level. I was just going straight for the, uh, the key. Which I think I still can. Please hurry. Oh, this is on the lower depth. I'm screwed. Okay, now I need to do this properly. I can't see why they didn't want to translate this over to the Switch because, I mean, it's not the end of the world, but it's just the 3D effect does help a little when it comes to discerning layers. I should have gone to the one next to me. Oh, I had a, I had a feeling. At least this one just makes me go back to this room, so it's not catastrophic. It's 
fine. Alright. Drop down one. All going to go to that ferry. Here. Oh. <laughs> okay, well that answers that. I need to get to the the other side of Turtle Rock. Except I need to be able to get up there, which I haven't figured out how to do yet. It's probably dropping from above. Mistake, haven't I? Okay. What? Oh. take the non-obvious path first. Okay, now I have all the keys I could ever want, so this is done. Big it as much. Alright, now... Heart piece, which means I need to find three more. <laughs> Imagine these heart pieces are in tiny chests and I've just ruled them out for no apparent reason. That would be funny. <laughs> almost, almost tempted to check.
Dun 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 dun. Ah. It's okay. Heels. Wait, where is this treasure chest that it's pointing at? Oh, you know, I think I know, I think I know what it is. I think I know what it is. It's going to be, I have to take out each of these worm things. I have to find out where they are. Haha. What's that? this there's nothing in here why was that room important There's gotta be a reason that room was important. Why else would I need to go there? Thank you. 
Oh. Ha! Okay. Alright. I don't know how that button blindsided me. Which means this room is most likely the same. Okay. Okay, if this boss is anything, it's gonna be fire and ice together. So I'm ready. Send the 3D effect down a little. Not what I was expecting as a boss. So, it would appear that I, I now have to hunt, hunt for heart pieces, so, you know. <laughs> I 
but otherwise doing okay. Okay. Ah, yes, here you are. I shouldn't have doubted the princess for a moment. You are the hero of our time. And what a splendid hero you make. You've endured so much to get this far. Harold is facing the same threat as in The Legend of Old, and you have much more to endure. Yet, we can help. Now that the seven you have united the seven sages, we can summon the Triforce of Courage. You must do as what the Hero of Legend did so long ago. Take it now. Oh, I was waiting for more. I thought there was going to be more here. Oh, I guess I should talk to him. <laughs> you have my undying gratitude, young hero. You are truly among the very best of your people. Now there is more for you to do. You're looking more and more like every hero should. But you're looking more and more like a hero every step of the way. I couldn't be proud of you, kid. Why'd I say that way? Okay. We have placed our full trust in you. Now onward and upward. Save the princess of Hyrule. I think I'm gonna go to Death Mountain with it and Hera because that's where I haven't really explored that much. All right, Lunkles, come back safely, okay? Well done, given all that you've accomplished, it's obvious why fate chose you to be our hero. Hmm, honestly, as a sage, I have seen greatness within you since the very first time we met. You are Hyrule's greatest hero, so I beg the gods to favor you, Lunkles. Wow, I just can't believe it, Lunkles. You saved every seven sage. My papa can't call you lazy anymore, but I bet he will anyway. You have claimed the power of the gods, Lincolns. With this, you can return. You can stop the return of the Demon King and thwart his evil ambitions. Now, hero, you must take the battle to Lowell Castle. There awaits the Demon King. May you and Princess Zelda survive the terrible trials ahead. Go now and defeat these evil once and for all. Beat the game? No, no way. There's still stuff to do. I mean, it usually ends in the Triforce collection, but now we are, uh, we gotta keep going. That was only an hour and a half to get both dungeons done. That was quick. And I felt like I struggled in the Swamp Palace, but... I guess I was expecting the Red Tunic. But it's possible. Ah, uh, there's something. It's okay, I can just do this right away.
The music is different as well now. Disappointing. Not enough. How is this not enough yet? I have grand much thanks to you. Let me give you this bottle. No, come on, really? That's all that was? Like, how many thousands for bottles? That's it? That's what it was. A bottle. That is pretty underwhelming given what it gives you in the link to the past. 3k for a bottle? Whoa. Okay. <laughs> okay. Cool. Glad I did that. What does it give you in a link to the past? Every t uh, there's like a, a threshold. So every X amount of rupees, it'll increase how many bombs you can- You get a choice, you can increase bombs or arrows. But you just keep donating and eventually you get all of it. So you end up with uh, a lot of bombs and arrows that you can use, which is very useful in that game. Checking here. I swear the I swear. There was a cave. <laughs> Did I know about the soft reset? It's a common thing in 3DS games. You do that in Pokemon, so I, I know about the soft reset. Maybe I already have this. So now this is a case of heart piece hunting, which... Trying to find a way into the dark world from this area. Okay, hold on. There has to be a way, in way into the dark world from here. Because this bridge doesn't exist, there's a wall here. 
So I can't get up here. So how do you get to this top corner? There's definitely a way up here. Oh, but see, this is a way out, it's not a way in. Hmm. I just, I've been leaving it out. Because I, I thought maybe I would eventually end up there, but... Doesn't look like it's going to be the case, so... Alright, let's just go from here. Apparently I just didn't walk over here. Why? Treacherous tower? <laughs> Can't believe I, play I paid 3,000 for a bottle. I could have bought the rest of the weapons with that money. Who are you? Well, boom, boom, sword boy. Welcome to the treacherous tower. You look pretty fit there. Wanna play? Okay. That's the spirit sword boy. The rules are super simple. A bunch of baddies are going to attack you. Just beat them. You look like you can take care of yourself, but since it's your first time, stick to the beginner's course. Uh, okay. Forgot to tell you, returning alive is not guaranteed. <laughs> okay, chat. This is the strategy. Oh, it's a new room. Okay, I can't do that. I thought it was going to keep spawning stuff. <laughs> I was going to cheese it and do corner strats and just reinforce myself with arrows and the boomerang to stun. It was smart. Okay, I'm gonna I'm just gonna wait for my magic to come back. Give it a minute. Okay. You know what? I think at the Desert Palace there was a heart that I missed. Or the top right corner. I remember I wanted to go there, but I just didn't bother. That was it? Okay. Is 
Is your score based on how much health you still have? Wow, you made it back. That's like crazy. Your clear time was 1 minute 34 seconds. Oh. Oh. Wait, it's a piece of heart. It's a piece of heart. <laughs> Alright, so that just leaves two then. Unaccounted for. I wanted to heal, but... Alright, screw it. Just go in. Tons of baddies cost 200 rupees. Alright, let's go. Didn't think that was it. of where the other ore piece is. Since it grades me on time. Ha! Okay. room sucks. Okay, they're all done. Ugh. This is probably still Fire Rod. Uh, 
I forgot how to beat these things. But that's that's the answer. Oh no. I don't think boomerang works here. Oh, it does. <laughs> Never mind. Game, please. Ice. Crap, that's a lot of money. That was my heart piece. I can't believe it. Well, I can. I can believe it. But I can't believe it. Amazing. Your clear time was three minutes. If you can beat your time. And since you cleared this course for the first time. Okay, cool. Take a crack at the advanced course. 50 floors. No, thank you. Oh, you know what? Ugh. What's this called? I should check what the reward is. Because it might be the ore. Um, a link between worlds. It's the tower game, right? Treacherous Tower, that's the one. I just want to see that I'm not. Oh, it goes for a while. What are the rewards? Where are, where are my rewards? Okay, there, there are rewards for it, but <laughs> they're, they're not really worth it. So, uh, according to this, it's if you clear the advanced course um, the first time, your lamp becomes the super lamp, which it does damage. And it's like, oh, I'm not really using the lamp for damage anyway. And then the other one is the net becomes the super net, which... Uh, I'm not catching it bugs anymore, so it's like... Why? Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> I'm just debating whether I should do it. Screw it, I won't. It just doesn't- it doesn't seem worth it. It's not 100% in the game, technically, but... Okay. I worry that I might have to just... Go back into dungeons. What the super net? What is? Does it, what, I didn't even look at what it did. I just read super net and was like, I'm not interested. 
What does it what does it say? Eight times damage. <laughs> it's not worth it. I'd rather spend the time finding the heart pieces. Okay, hang on. not what I wanted to come here for. Hold up. How do I get back to... You know, I'm, I'm gonna figure this out myself. But it, it's doing a hundred floors, effectively. to do this, but I'm gonna have to go into dungeons and just check that I've gotten all chests. I don't even have the red armor yet either, which I, I imagine I, I'm just an idiot and I missed it. Okay, there's a chest here. All right. All oh, right, it's this shit. Forgot about this dungeon. Right, I never worked this out. Hang on. That's it, right? It's just. I think that's what I'm gonna prioritize now. Is just uh. to go through the dungeon. Okay, hang on. I don't know if this is worth the effort. There's also still the, the Master Ore. I need to find another piece of it. Red is very late game. I'm up to the, what presumably is the final dungeon. Or is it straight up just you get it in the final dungeon? Wait. Was this a ki this I got Master Ore in this dungeon, didn't I? I did. Because there's two, there's two chests. Okay, I vaguely remember this. That was Master Ore. But I just... I don't want to rule out. It's 
that's not here. <sighs> okay, does anyone wanna, in a non-spoiler way, tell me if I should be searching treasure, treasure chests in dungeons? Or at least the remainder ones. Okay, I've got two big ones here, so I imagine there's nothing here. The four heart pieces, yes. I'm leaving here. Uh, this is just where the painting was. There's still a chest here. What is this chest? This one. That's just a little one. Wait, what is that? There's another one. One is in a chest, but not in the usual way. What? <sighs> Why can't this be consistent? Okay, left side of the map on B1. Oh no, it goes up. It's on... B. No, yeah. Okay, here. <gasps> what? What do you, what do you, what? <laughs> what do you mean? How, how? Low level sword, Andy. <laughs> it's tier two. I guess I can make a tier three now. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> I'm gonna, uh... I think I need to check the dungeons again. Yeah. I think I might need to take I think I might need to check dungeons again. <laughs> How did that happen? How did I'm going to have to watch the vod later. I don't know. I'm going to have to watch the VOD later. It's just, it's right there. How did I not see that? In my defense, it, it could have potentially also been late at night. I don't know. I mean, it generally is when I'm playing, right? I'm just not gonna worry about that shit. How did I? <laughs> what? Oh, oh. What? <laughs> oh, this this has broken me. Ah. <laughs> uh... Okay, what's the next dungeon in the dark world? 
You know what? I've done, I just did Turtle Rock. Pretty confident there. We can rule out Swamp Palace. That's where I got the... The, uh... The blue tunic, so that's fine. Alright, I'm going to Dark Palace. I checked the map to the to the desert palace. It seemed fine. Right. There was there was a chest there that I never figured out. Uh Okay. I guess it depends what kind of chest it is. This one, I think, was definitely just a brain fart. Uh, I'm just gonna go through the green portal. It's probably easier. I think it's just any dungeon where I, I had a headache trying to solve it. That's where I miss stuff. This was one of these dungeons. It took me a while to do this one. I think that's what we can we can blame it on is just if there is something here, it's probably because yeah, I was running around in circles for ages. Did I get the master all from here? N It's the master or isn't it? <laughs> it's going to be the the master or isn't it? Now come on, this dungeon sucked for me. You thought my sword level was two it is two. The sword is crimson, it's red. I got it tempered by the light world blacksmith, and then the, the dark world blacksmith was like, go find two more. Where am I? Okay, you know what? I need to do this. I never figured out how to get in there. Wait, what? What is going on with the visuals? Is this normal? The visuals are inverted. Why? What the fuck? I never saw the map like this. Or is this because of just the light? Weird. At least I know it's worthwhile. Yeah, but I never figured out how to get in there. It was blocked off completely. Visuals are normal, yeah, yeah. It's okay. Right, so... Go up one more. Yeah, this is the part I just never worked out, because there doesn't appear to be a way in there. I did try bombing, but it just didn't work. Hmm.
Oof, that was close. Almost forgot about that. So it's behind this here. I tried using a bomb, but there wasn't anything there. I guess light the torches. Oops. Maybe I can see something that I missed. anything though. The only thing I could think of was merging with this thing, but it's not it's not a thing. And then the previous floor there was nothing here. There's there's something to this, but I'm not sure what it is. Unless there's like a hidden button or something. I'm not sure what this is. It's super unintuitive, awful design. Should I just look it up? Is this something that's just gonna drive me insane for an hour? And it's not gonna be worth watching <laughs> this? Okay. That was a fluke. All right, let's get out of here. It doesn't matter. Well, yeah, but. It's not like I figured it out, that was purely... I was just thinking, okay, what's going to be like the most stupid thing I could think of, and then it was correct. <laughs> I just dumbed it down, like, what is... What is the thing in this room that could be the dumbest solution? What the... And it ended up being the solution, so... I just want to leave now.
Wait, is the heart paste is is the heart paste thing? Is the heart paste thing the chest mini game? Because I've already done the chest mini game. If that's what you mean, that it's technically in a chest. Because I have done the the chest mini game already. Here I am, I finally found some motivation, and we don't have any of that master wall. Without that, I can't power up your- Oh. Whoa. Whoa! Look at what you've got, just look at it. With that master ore, I can strengthen your sword. How about it? Boy, come on now, let's get to tempering this guy's sword. Give me a hand now. Okay, let's do it. My arms are itching to start smithing. Okay. I talk a good game, but now it's time for me to back it up. Mm-hmm. There we have it. The Golden Sword. What do you think? I told you I was number one. This here is the mightiest sword there is. Now you're gonna be unstoppable, kid. Yeah, look it. It's a fine piece of work. A fine piece of work indeed. Okay, well, this is a problem now, like... If not, if not dungeons... I'm gonna have to think where I haven't really explored the overworld that well. I'm gonna go buy some weapons, the remainder weapons. A warm welcome to you. Oh, I thought it was going to say thank you. See the Maya Maya. I just love how the music does this. <laughs> the moment the upgrade starts, it's funny. Just have to earn a thousand and then that's all the items. Okay, I mean, are there any hearts that I saw and then um, I was like, I couldn't get them? because I just didn't have the item. Is that a possibility? Ah! 
because I'm having a hard time thinking where I could have missed them. Unfortunately, I'm not familiar with the game enough to know specifically where. But I mean, I know some... Maybe the minigames. What are, what are the minigames? There's only two remaining. I can tell you which ones that I feel like I've gotten. So, like, I did get this one here because I was happy that this was in the game. I just- I did Treacherous Tower, yeah, just before. That was the most recent one, Treacherous Tower. So I've done Baseball, the two coin games. Um, I did the chicken game. I've done Treachery Tower. Are there any other mini games? I might go around Zora's Domain. Maybe there's some waterfall that I missed or something. So, this is one of these areas that I kind of just skim through. I'll go from the top. There's a waterfall. There's a cave there. This is just the, where the queen lives. Okay, well, whatever was in here is gone. Remember the iceberg incident? Iceberg incident? <laughs> like Wind Waker? The, the fuck up in Wind Waker? I don't wanna- I don't wanna resort to a list just yet. It's a- Oh. But I bomb but I bombed that wall though. I did put a bomb there and you were disappointed. And then that conversation came up. Is that bombable? Hang on. I mean, it might, it might just be a, a case where I've just not done something.
Yeah, this was a heart piece. I remember this, so. This is gonna bother me now. Did I get any from Death Mountain? I got one from Death Mountain. It was like, I fell between... Well, there was like a wall, and then I fell between, and there was a, like, back way to it. And that led to a heart piece. Oh yeah, this is just this room again, okay. Oh, and I think there was also the one on the east side where, like, it was... Volcano area, and I had to climb. That one was like depth perception hell. How is it two, though? Like, unless another game gives you. One, I don't know. There are three on Death Mountain. Okay, let me think. But are you counting Death Mountain as in... Okay. So there's the one where it's the floating island in the cloud. In the clouds, you need to use the Dark World Warp to get there. I got that one. I got the one on the west side of Death Mountain. Which, that one, it was just a drop, and that was pretty easy. And then the last one I got was one where I had to go through, the, like, the volcano area. I had to climb um, using, like, these <laughs> sausage-looking things. The sausage buttons. <laughs> as they were affectionately referred to as. I'm kind of just going where I'm seeing stuff that's out of place. Okay, here's one. Alright, so only one remains. Okay, this was a puzzle that I didn't do, but I imagine this is just money. Let me just look across. I'm pretty sure it's just money. I looked at it and I was like, eh, yeah. Yeah, the, the one that you go through the ice ruins, that, I got that one. That one's on the floating island in Death Mountain. It's the same one from A Link to the Past. It's a similar method, so I did get that one. I think any of the heart pieces that mirror A Link to the Past, it's pretty safe that I've gotten them. I'm not checking the Dark Woods or the Dark Palace because there was a heart piece there, so I doubt there's a second one there. Okay, hold up. There is something else that I remember. Is this something? Because... 
Or is that just an exit? Because... That's just an exit, right? From where you, you get the sword. But I mean, otherwise, I think I've gotten everything here. There was a heart piece here. Very early on. That I got. It was... Where was it? It was somewhere here. Not here. It was here. Well, somewhere here. I... I squeezed in somewhere where I shouldn't... Ha here. It was here. So there was a heart piece here. I find this warp point very weird that it didn't have anything. There was a heart piece there. Gonna check the vault. That's the only spot that I, I off the top of my head, was something that... I remember being out of place. I mean, outside of that, I'm not sure where else I haven't been. I'm trying to move and look and chat at the same time. It's probably not the best idea. I did get the very first one that was in Sanctuaries. The lady in the closet gave me one. I got the one in Turtle Rock. Uh, that was the one where it's like an island on the left, yes. It's gotta be something from early on. It would have to be, because the most recent ones, I feel like I've been on top of it. Okay, this was a heart piece that I got. There was a chicken. I had used a chicken to get across. And there was one here. So I think that more or less rules this part out. What about... Let's go here. Let's see if there's any, maybe, entries that I've missed with Big Bomb. Oh, 
This is gonna bother me immensely. Did I get any behind someone's house? Find someone's house? I think there was one here. And it was just on this ledge here. You know where it is? <laughs> what, was it that one? There was one also here. No? Is it a minigame I missed? Hmm. It's in low rule. Where? Or was this because of a VOD and you saw me go past it? Sahasrala? What? The hostel is in low roll. No, if you, okay, I think I know which one you're referring to. If you're talking about this one, where directly underneath the spot there's there's like an alcove. I have this one. There. I've already got that one. I'm gonna bet that it's one of the earlier ones. I think I might just have to go to a list and just see. And just do the ruling out thing. Because I don't want this to be a repeat of Wind Waker. I, I really, I don't think it's in anyone's best interest that we repeat what happened in Wind Waker. This is starting to get scarily close to what happened. We'll give myself 10 more minutes. If I can't find it in 10 minutes, I'm resorting to a list. Okay, hold up. In the interest of Sani, I'm gonna check that minigame. I got the one right next to Hyrule Cup. Oh wait, you ready? No, it's still the same. Pretty sure I got this one. I swear I did this one, but he did say piece of heart. I guess we'll see the result here. Oh, it's here. No, it's here. Okay. Oh, did I just run out? It might have been a case where I ran out of money. Oh! I know what happened. I know what happened. I know what happened. Do you remember the baseball game? How I accidentally exited the game? And then I lost some progress? I did get this piece, but then that happened, and I lost the progress. That's what happened. Okay, mystery solved.
Yeah. Well, I I definitely got this one. But what this is that's exactly what happened. What happened was the baseball game. And I I quit the I thinking I quit the baseball game and said I quit the game and I lost some progress. So that progress included me completing this. Okay, does anyone want to have a crack? I'll tell you what. Give me so this is obviously for a number from 1 to 15, so one. this is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, you know, 6, 7, 8, etc, etc. Give me three numbers. 12, alright. We got 4, 12, and 8. 4, 12, and 8, alright. So 4... Yep. This is 12. This is 8. Anyone want to try? I'll tell you, I'll restrict it to one number per person. One number per person. Alright, starting now. Okay. Nine, five, and three. Okay. There's three. Uh, this is five. And this is nine. No luck. All right, reset. It's the first three numbers I see on screen. So <laughs> this this truly sucks because I might have to go get more money. Not yet. When I when I say so. When I say so. Don't cheat. Okay. When I say now. Now. Okay, seven. <laughs> Is that an eight? Okay, an eight. It was number eight. Very close, very close. Oops. So, d d I, I guess? Alright. Save it before anything bad happens. See, audience participation is is important. Do you want to know how I found it the first time? Why are the hearts on the bottom? Because if you think about it, there's a second screen underneath, so it's directly above the second screen. The way that I solved it, I kept getting it wrong. It was always next to one of the ones I picked. So I was like, all right, I'm just going to pick a spot and then pick the one next to it. And then it worked. Unfortunately, I lost that progress. I'm so glad I did that sanity check, because otherwise I would have been walking around in circles. It would have been a repeat of Wind Waker. Because I would have gone through the list and I would have been like, no, I've done, I've done the chess game. I have done it. Okay, that's not real. Might have been a bit... Yeah, a bit too early. I panicked. Okay. 
Okay, here's the, here's the thing, chat. If I go do the tower, if I, if I go do the uh, the tower game, we're not gonna finish this tonight. So there's a choice. I can go do the tower game and get the upgrades for the net and the lantern, or I could march to the end. Which would you prefer? Because if I don't, if I do the tower thing, that's the last thing I'm gonna do today. Because it's gonna take a while. Go to the end instead. Anyone else? <laughs> Just more than one. Hang on. Because the tower thing is just, ugh. It's 50 rounds. And I have to do that twice, so it's 100 rounds total. That's going to take a while. Damn, I'm off now. I guess I'm tired. What? Hyrule Ro Warriors doesn't count as canon. Hyrule Warriors is, uh... Is not considered mainline, I should say. Triforce Heroes is supposed to be next. Same thing? No, it's not. A little bit better, but not by much. I did want to purchase the last item. So maybe I should just do that. It's the sand rod, so it should be like about... Okay. It's a shame. I missed out just by a little bit. My timing's gotten worse. I had this down every time. Good one. I'm gonna try my best to get this right. Ah, oh, are you kidding? I missed by point two of a second. Ah, screw it. <laughs> What's the sand rod gonna get me? That sucked. That was like almost right on the money. Alright. Well.
Guess it's time. Oh, wait. No, it's not. I lied to you. <laughs> I gotta get potions first. Gotta make the necessary preparations as this is the end. So wait, one other thing, for the Maya Mayas, do you get anything for rescuing them all? Because I did, but nothing happened. But how come nothing happened then? I have to upgrade all the items first. Oh, is it worth it? Upgrades the spin attack. Nah, I'm, uh, I'll pass. I don't use it at all. I shall pass. Alright, I had an extra bottle. I forgot about my 4,000 rupee bottle. It's fine. That'll work too. It does more than a fairy. So I have one resurrect and then I have a light heal and three heavy heals. I'm being dramatic about what? Oh, it was only 3,000. My, my apologies. <laughs> it's like... The I thought the, the bug metal was... Uh... Was the ripoff? No. <laughs> That one hurt a lot as well because I was using my knowledge of A Link to the Past and I was like, yeah, you watch, this reward's gonna be great. It was in A Link to the Past. Alright. Can you hear me, Hero of Hyrule? You have arrived just in time, for Yuga has escaped my bonds, and his minions are loose in Lorul Castle. Give me a moment while I remove the barrier that protects my castle, then make haste, Lunkles. Here we go. This music, though. Oh, right, it should. There we go. So, wait, I, this this game took me three days. We're gonna we're gonna be doing Breath of the Wild in a week. If if this says anything about Triforce Heroes, Breath of the Wild is gonna happen in a week. Which get yeah, it gives me about a month to get it done. Am I taking tomorrow off? Uh, tomorrow's a public... Tomorrow's Sunday. So I don't work Sunday. Uh, and then Monday's a public holiday. This is the, uh... The Easter weekend, so there's a lot of streaming happening. But otherwise, when it goes back to normal, it's just evening times, and then I'm not gonna be up super late because I have to work the next day.
Are you meant for streaming? No. I mean, you, that's usually Tuesdays for me. Those are the days that I, uh, the day that I pick, like, nah, I'll just chill. thing. I mean, I should probably take more than one night off a week from streaming, but... Don't worry about that later. Hmm. Just this last week or so, I just wanted to make sure Skyward Sword got done in a good amount of time. I did the same with Twilight Princess because those were the two that I was worried was going to take a while. And might just cut into the time that I had for Breath of the Wild at the end. I can't fall off this yet. like a survey. Do you think I should take more of a night off chat? Oh, uh, hello, Neon Leon. Thank you for the raid. How's it going? A Link Between Worlds is awesome. It is. It's one of my favorite 2D Zeldas. Hey Lord Renzo, welcome. I'm playing through the Zelda games in the lead up to Tears of the Kingdom, so I've been playing all of them. In uh, chronological order of release, so... Nearly, nearly through it. It was your first Zelda. Oh, cool. I like this one because it reminds me of one, uh, my favorite one, which is A Link to the Past. Okay, yeah, got it. Never met someone who doesn't like this game. This one was good in its own merit, but also... Just the fact that it's it's similar to like one of the most beloved ones. Wait, does this work? Yeah, it does. My memories of this are vague because it's been a very long time. So Zelda 2. What about Zelda 2? I think Zelda 2 is fine. I'm one of those people that enjoy Zelda 2. Especially with the fan remake now that just makes it a lot better. I should have brought that with me. I just want to clear up the head first. Uh, 
Haha. Okay, that's going to be a problem on its own. Okay, bring ice rods. No, that and that. There we go. Wait, what? I ice rod would work too, would not it? I guess not far enough. Wait, didn't that dude with the bomb flower shop say this was the only way to get one or something? Along the lines, like, made it sound like it was an exclusive? be fine. <laughs> Unless this is... Oh. Okay. This is a more aggressive version. This music is really epic. complicating this. <laughs> Had the right idea, just poor execution. Oh, it doesn't get any further than that. it a little easier. Uh, 
Uh, oh. That would have been into the lava. to have problems with this one. Oh, wait a minute. I know what I'm doing wrong. There we go. Must have dropped down. Yeah, I dropped down. I should have dropped down. up a little with the shocking, but it's okay. I think if I need to heal, I can just leave the dungeon and come back. It's no biggie.
giving me a lot of money just so I can, uh... Hmm. Oh. That's one of these. Not allowed to merge onto wall. Ah. Nearly. <laughs> Not worth it. But sure. This is gonna get me more health, but seems to be working. Good enough. Is this just a fake out? No. This is a valid way to see hidden paths. Let me see. There's got to be a way to do this. Yeah, okay. That, that works. Oh, wait a minute. Haha. -ha. I wonder if this is going to be anything. Oh, this is already something. So then, is this something? So...
just making sure I keep track of this. Lantern, apparently. Am I going to regret not upgrading my lantern to do damage? <laughs> There's something I'm not getting to this. Ah, it's the opposite. Memorization. This part sucks. I was trying to that's trying to be cheeky. Yeah, it doesn't like you. <laughs> There was more to that room, though. From what I could see, there was a passageway. 
the side. What is what is that? There's not there's something there. Oh, what? The fuck? Oh, this is just, ah, uh, okay. This is... <laughs> okay, I got baited. It was just to head back. I can't get to it. I don't think this is fake. Yeah, it's not fake. Doesn't work. <laughs> I wish it did. You know, at this rate, I might have enough to upgrade or well, purchase the final item. That thing that, uh... I was like, nah, don't do it. this. Ah, oh, it's blocked. I need, I need the, the floor master, whatever that thing's called.
There you are. Hello. trying to be smart. Did I reset the whole thing? No. Some of it, not all of it. What? <laughs> that was not cool. for a minute. Okay. Because apparently I, I jump up. I got it. I got why. Yes. What? Why does it not register that gap? Okay, whatever, you know what that works. It worked. Oh, it's you again.
What am I doing worse on this one? The first time I fought this dude went really well. Here's the thing, chat. <laughs> you might note how much... Okay. You might note how much money I have now. This makes sense to do. Not that. Okay, especially now. not done. I'm just coming here to buy the weapon. The red tunic is, I would assume is in that chest that I haven't gotten yet. Oh, it was only 800. Rip. That's everything though. At last, I've sold all my items. Yay for me. Thanks to your efforts, Mr. Hero. I've made a great prof... <laughs> I mean, I've made a great friend. And there's just one more thing. I'm closing down my shop. I mean, I sold you everything, so I can finally retire and live the good life. Whoop, whoop, boopy, whoop, 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 whoop. Sorry, I just had to get that out of my system. I think I'm going to kick my feet up for a while and figure out what I'm going to do next. Anyway, I just gotta bow down to you, Mr. Hero. I can't believe that you found so many rupees for me. Now, best of luck out there. Me and Shiro here will hold down the fort for you. I mean, I, d I do appreciate that it's implied dude was just there to scam. Well, if this is the case... You found all my babies. Please take this from Mother Maya Mai. <laughs> right. I mean, was there no other way to do that? Mother Maya Mai can't thank you enough. You found all my Maya Mai's. You're a nice child. Very nice. <laughs> yeah, okay. It's pretty big radius. <laughs> my, my, my. I may as well fill these up. 
with blue now. get up. This is it. Oh wait, I'm an idiot. I was going to Hyrule Castle. I was meant to do this. <laughs> We're going to Lowrule Castle. Okay. I just have to figure out how to get that big chest, that's all now. I have a feeling, I think I know what it is. something like that. Okay, we are complete. prepared me already, huh? What? Isn't this the room I was getting to? Or is this just another secret? <laughs> okay. Um... Oh wait, I'm an idiot. Let's go right, isn't it? Alright. Here we go. I thought that was gonna be health, but okay. There's no save point here. Alright. I'm going to leave it like this because there's no point to the map anymore, so this is how we're going to fight with this. Unless there's something to do with the bottom screen, I'll leave the layout like this now, chat. You have done well to come so far, Hero of Hyrule. I trust you have the Triforce of Courage.
Perhaps it is only fair that I share a story with you. It's the legend of how Laurel fell into its current condition. Long ago, Laurel possessed a sacred golden treasure. It could grant the wish of anyone who touched it. It was known as the Triforce in your, our world as it is in yours. Many sought to control the Triforce, plunging Laurel into endless war. Our kingdom was on the verge of ruin. My ancestors got rid of the Triforce to stop the war by destroying it utterly and completely. It was done with good intentions, but it has disastrous consequences. The Triforce was the foundation of our world, and without it, our kingdom crumbled. Chaos has since reigned in low rule. We need a Triforce, so imagine my surprise when I learned the existence of another one. Yours. A Triforce based on such virtues, power, wisdom, and courage. To that end, I have guided your destiny, Hero of Hyrule. As the Princess of Low Rule, it is my duty to save my kingdom, so I, I, I know you'll understand it when I say... It must... I must have your Triforce of Courage! <laughs> I mean, I saw this coming on the mile away. She did say that everyone in Low Rule was bad. Yuga, I command you, seize the Triforce of Courage from him. Laurel shall be reborn. What a twist! Oh, this music, love it. The fact that it has this as the final boss music, it just gives me confidence about the fight. Because it puts me in a place where I'm finishing this. is getting hard to use. appreciate the classic moveset here. Hold up. Ugh. Analog stick is Jeez, I'm losing grip on it. Alright, there we go. Better. Someone sitting on the remote. That was me wiping the, uh, the analog stick clean. 
Give me your Triforce of Power, Yuga. You mustn't be defeated. If we are, Laurel will be lost forever. Come on. Now, obey me. Give it to me at once. <laughs> My dear, sweet, deluded Hilda. What care have I to save your crumbling kingdom? It's no better than that hideous Hyrule. When the Triforce is mine, I plan to remake Lurul in my image. Now you, my dark beauty, must serve your purpose. I can hardly decide which one of my princess portraits is better. But I do know which of you foolish royal girls has what I needed, and now it will be mine. Okay. Haha, I shall soon take my rightful place among the gods. And then the beauty of destruction will rain down upon this world. Oh, he's still green underneath. <laughs> Hello, wait. Apology is that if I mispronounce the word, but I'm just gonna say way in a wano. Now I'll be taking that last piece of the trifles from you. Worm! How far you've wriggled, but at last you know your true destiny to give me what's mine. Okay, here we go. This music! Just seeing if there's a different color orb. Doesn't look like there is. Oh, it's okay, it's the volley thing. Oof. Okay, can't spam. Terrible with anything with exact timing on it. It is I, Princess Zelda. Your current weapons will be useless while Yuga is a painting. So I bestow upon you, my hero, one more gift. Okay. 
This bow is imbued with the light of the Triforce and can be fired only while you merge into the wall. You cannot escape its radiance, even in painted form. Now for the sake of our worlds, let fly these arrows and may your aim be true. I got it. Smarty's running. Ha! Okay, I can't hit him. Double. That sucks. That's pretty funny. Curses! If I only turned around! Damn you, hindsight! <laughs> Thanks for the GG. Ugh. Thought she was gonna say something. <laughs> what? What more can I do? So it was you who had me in prison in that painting, Princess Hilda. Obviously. Please, Princess Hilda. No one understands the sacred duty the princess has to her people more than I. But you can't. You understand nothing! Your kingdom has been under the protection of your Triforce. But that's... This isn't over, I must have it! Please, this has to stop.
<laughs> I'm sorry, the face. Link's look, looks of uh, surprise in every game, they just make me laugh. I don't know why. Well, funny story there. Your hero and I have gotten to know each other pretty well. But not long ago, I served Princess Hilda here in Low Rule. So, begging your pardon, Princess Zelda. But would you mind if I intervene here? Your Royal Highness. You vanished on me and now you come crawling back? Why? Forgive me, Your Highness. I'm a coward at heart. I just realized what this is. Chat. Link has the Triforce of Courage. His opposite is a coward. Zelda has the Triforce of Wisdom. Her opposite is a fool. And, uh, you know, Ganon's counterpart, Power, is, uh, was pretty weak, if you think about it. <laughs> there was no way that I had the courage to stand up to you and Yuga. But I was smart enough to go to Hyrule. I knew they'd have a hero who could help me. Another betrayal? This hero has proven useful to me. But you? You wanted to, him to defeat me? I'm sorry, my princess, but it was with the best of intentions. I wish the best for our kingdom, but ruining Hyrule? Also, Link doesn't talk, this dude does, so definitely his opposite. <laughs> You'd bring out the absolute worst in Lurul. You'd rather see Lurul crumble? No, no, of course not, princess. But there must be some other way. No! Don't you realize the reason your noble ancestors destroyed our Triforce was to stop such chaos. That's not what I... I... Look around you. This is exactly what happened with our Triforce. Oh no. Princess Hilda, I... I just wanted to save you from all this. You, who've worried endlessly about the fate of Low Rule. Please, Princess Hilda, let's do the right thing. Low Rule may be doomed, but at least our kingdom won't be condemned for stealing their Triforce. You're right. Princess Alda, I have been led astray, tempted by the power of your Triforce, but I swear, I did it for my people. Please, Princess Hilda, there is no need to. No, please, let me finish. You are fortunate to have a hero like Lunkels. What courage he has displayed, that alone proves that Hyrule deserves a Triforce. Now, I will ensure that you leave this dark kingdom of mine safely and with your Triforce. Please follow me, I know of a way that you can go home. Welcome to Low Rule's sacred realm. You get discovered that there was a strange crack in this grim slate. Through it, we could sense that there was another world beyond ours, a place where the Triforce still existed. He and I devised a scheme that imperiled your kingdom, but I alone will set this right. Was Ravio right-handed? Uh, I don't know, didn't notice. Never held a weapon. Please now, if you'll give me a bracelet, Lunkles. I think my theory is pretty good, though. It's like... He was a coward, she was foolish, and the other guy was weak. I should be able to use the last of its power to send you, the both of you home to Hyrule. <laughs> I 
It's been a pleasure, my friend. I got to meet a real, live, genuine hero. Ha, who knows? Maybe some of your courage dropped off on me. Thanks, Linkles. He has his giant sack of money. <laughs> All that money I spent on on weapons. Hey. Can you hear me? Please open your eyes, Loonkles. Aww. War profiteering? <laughs> oh, I'm so glad you're alright. Hey. And look, Loonkles. How wonderful. We're back home. You know, I've never seen the Triforce Hall. Let's go take a closer look, Linkles. How terribly sad for Princess Hilda to be driven to such desperation. Her kingdom was in such a worry state. Sorry state. She and I aren't as different as she thought. I really do understand why she needed our Triforce. Thanks to uh, your heroic efforts, our Triforce and Hyrule itself will have been made whole again. There is just one thing left to do, Linkles. You restored the Triforce, now reach out and touch it. Whatever you wish, it will be granted. Yet, after all that we've seen, do we not share the same wish? Let's make the wish together. Infinite money. <laughs> that would have been useful. Thank you, Princess Zelda. Oh, thank you. And to you as well, Hero of Hyrule. Thank you, Linkles. Okay. It's another one down. Beautiful ending, now it's nuggy time. <laughs> that sounds like a good idea. Okay, so that was uh, Link Between Worlds chat. It's one of my favorite 2D ones, so... I did enjoy this one. Enjoy the nuggies, Messiah. Thanks for hanging out. Tomorrow we start... Triforce Heroes. Triforce Heroes is the last one before Breath of the Wild, so that one was also on the 3DS, but yeah. I can't imagine it's going to be long as uh, 
as any of these ones, so... We'll see how we go. I don't know. I'm confident that I can maybe get to Breath of the Wild next weekend. If This took three days. Granted, I did play it quite a bit, but it took three days. It's possible that Triforce Heroes might be as long as this, because it is a 3DS game as well, so... That is, uh... I'll try, but you know. I think we're looking good for uh, Breath of the Wild starting next weekend. <sighs> Closing thoughts on, on this, uh... I mean... It's just because it's so reminiscent of, uh... A Link to the Past that I really did enjoy this one, but it stands up on its own two feet. I think it's definitely a good introduction to the series if this was your first as well. The one thing that weirded me out about it at the start when I played it, not this time, but, you know, the first time, was just the fact that the weapons were rented. I did find it strange that I could get all the weapons if I wanted to right away. But, uh, yeah. Some of the dungeons were tough enough that I was taking damage to the point where, oh no, I lost my items accidentally. Oh, thank you for the follow, I appreciate that. Yeah, uh, Triforce Heroes, I'm gonna be playing it single player, because... For those that don't know, that game... You could play it two ways, you could... Control the Link characters yourself, or you could play co-op. And that was the appeal of it. But... Uh, yeah. <laughs> it's kinda hard to... Set up multiplayer. Realistically, so... We'll be doing single player, and uh... I can't imagine it's gonna take the whole week. We'll see. I'm just... Yeah, this music was great. <laughs> <laughs> so let me let me just make some calculations here. Hold on. I just want to see. Uh, what is Tears of the Kingdom's actual release date? This is what I want to find out. Twelfth of May. Twelfth of May. So if I can get Triforce Heroes done before the end of this week, it gives me roughly a month to get through Breath of the Wild. So I think that that's pretty good. I think it, it'll it'll be just right in terms of how much time. The end. Okay, well, I don't think there's anything else now. That's, uh, that's it. It pops up. So, this is where, uh, I'm gonna wrap up the stream for tonight, chat. I do hope you enjoyed the stream, but also the playthrough. Uh, yeah, thanks for hanging out, especially if you're new around here. Oh, boy. I don't want to see this. Um... Yeah, thanks for checking out the stream. Whilst, uh, I'm away, I'll be back tomorrow. We'll start Triforce Heroes tomorrow. You can always go to YouTube to watch more of my content. I have three channels over there. Just search for this stream title channel thing over there. You'll find it. And, uh, you can watch past streams, highlights, and shorts. Also the occasional stream over there. So... Hope you do check that out, and if you're watching later on YouTube, you can subscribe to know when things are uploaded. And also, if you want to support the streams, whatever channel, 
Just do anything that the algorithm will like. <laughs> Don't have to, though, but appreciate anyone that does. All right. Uh, thank you for watching, everyone. Uh, enjoy your Easter if you do partake in that stuff. Otherwise, just have a nice rest of your day. Yeah? And uh, we'll start a link between worlds. Not a link between worlds. Triforce Heroes tomorrow. Jeez. See? I should go to bed. All right. Take care, everyone.